So, I just want to go racing you. I don't really, I don't care what, what I want to go on, right? I don't care what. I just want to go write music. I'm in the mood. And I'm going to go use some band lab. Oh, okay. Here. Oh, God. Come on. Class I already signed up. I use the Google. Not me. My incorrect credentials. Uh -huh. Whatever. Anyways, I'm in. Um, do some less than legal means. Just kidding. Well, I have an online app. Sure. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, let's just go create some. Oh, some. Some music. I don't know. What do we want first? Let's just go with the drum machine. Um. Okay. Alright. Okay. There we go. Go see. Alright, okay. So, actually, you know what? I, I want to make a lead. I want to go make a lead synth first. So, yeah. Usually I do start with my drums. Uh, but I'm feeling different. I want to go make a lead. Okay, lead synth. Okay, here, let's go look at... My Christ, I'm going to. Yeah, I'd... maybe a less, a little less. Re... Yeah, Berlin. Yeah, no. Huh. Hmm. Okay. No. Ooh, I could. Soften that a little. One second, I'm gonna go find my lead because this is probably boring. So I've got my synthesizer and let's go up an octave. Okay, and I'm gonna go add some effects to make it not as, like, reverb -y, so... I don't know, I don't really like that. Uh, the massive amount of reverb on... reverb on this into it, yeah. Where is my... Here. Oh, I'll just put some EQ on it first. Cause why not? Here, we'll, uh... Make this... A little high end. Um. Okay, I want the mid, higher, low, lower. Oh. Low. Okay, how about we just go for the high, lower? Mid is mid sweep then. Lower. There we go. Okay. Um, where's my reverb? I recommended filter echo studio reverb. Hmm. Size. Okay. Yeah. Here. Um. Here. Trying to think of um 
Modulation? No, I don't want like tremor or something. Tone? I already have EQ. Um. Distortion? Uh, maybe like a. Like a compressor or something like that. And just make it super subtle. Again, no. I want that to be a bit quieter. Okay. Huh. That's quite the interesting. do a bit of recording and there will be plenty of cursing in uh, this section because I am an awful, just absolutely awful at this. It takes so many attempts. Anyway, see you in like an hour. Okay, so I'm actually changing the um, synth uh, because it creates, here, it creates this annoying thing. Here, I'll do it. I'll, here, I'll show you. Here, if I just... So you hear the like um the oscillation I guess and I, I I can't solve that so I'm just changing the synth. Okay, I think I've got the main uh synth lead thing uh sort out. So yay. Then like what I don't know. I do know it's a bit piercing, and I and I, if I really wanted to, I could just go like that, um, and it'd be slightly less piercing. Uh, but that was just literally one adjustment of a knob, <laughs> and it did slightly help. Um, but uh, I think I think that's a pretty good synth line. On to drums and supporting instrumentals. So, uh, let's do drums. Uh, let's do, let's go make a C pattern. Uh, okay, what do we got? 808 kit? We usually do use 606. No. So yeah, that's like... Yes, please. This has all the bass, which was mainly what I was looking for. Okay, here. Let's see. We have... Here, so... So, I don't... That's like, what? Uh...
Yeah, that's not bad. Not bad, not bad. Yeah, so considering... Yeah, okay. There we go. Let's leave that over a few times. Hey, that's way too loud. Okay, I need to go. Okay, I'm gonna go make a very similar beat to a combined uh, C. So actually, I'm pretty happy, and I'll upload a separate video um, with uh, the actual like uh, high quality, non not just me playing it uh, uh, version of it. And so I hope you like that. Uh, end of video. Goodbye. That process took around 30 minutes, so it's uh, quicker than expected. Anyways, bye.